I'm here today with Justin Crooks, a senior engineer with SignalHound. Hi Deborah. nice to see you. Nice to see you too. I understand you have a new product out, the VSG25A. Do you want to tell me a little bit more about it? Sure, yeah, the VSG25A is our new vector signal generator. It operates from 100 megahertz to 2.5 gigahertz. The uh, output power is from minus 40 dBm to plus 10 dBm. And it produces basically all the waveforms you'd expect from a VSG. It has AM, FM pulse. Uh, it has the digital modulations like uh, you know, PSK and QAM, FSK, ASK, and uh, sweeps, and also ARB. Great. Who do you see using this nifty little instrument? Well, uh, you know, I used it for one. I used it uh, when we were developing our BB60C uh, digital modulation analysis software. Uh, because it produced all the modulation patterns we needed. Um, I think a, a lot of RF engineers would use it, you know, just to produce a digital modulation pattern for testing receivers. Uh, it also has a lot of uh, pulse capabilities and, uh, you know, even a hobbyist who just wants a low-cost FM generator, it would be perfect for $495. Well, what other notable characteristics does it have? Uh, well, it does have 100 megahertz of uh, output bandwidth, and it also has a 3.5 nanosecond uh, rise time for the pulses. Uh, that means, you know, it'd be great for testing, uh, you know, maybe some radar uh, simulations, or it can also produce arbitrary waveforms. So if you want, uh, you know, an FM chirp or something, it's a, a piece of cake for the VSG25A. Now, what about the digital modulation characteristics? Sure, uh, it can produce uh, BPSK, DBPSK, QPSK, uh, DQPSK, Pi over 4 DQPSK, uh, as 1664, 256 QAM, uh, and has uh, up to 512 symbols that uh, you can load into the memory. Well, that sounds really good. So it must have some natural limitations because it's so small. It only has uh, one low pass filter for the RF output. Uh, so the 2.7 gigahertz low pass filter doesn't do much for harmonics below about a gigahertz. Um, it also has uh, no reconstruction filter on the IQ baseband. Uh, so what you end up with is some very predictable spurious out of channel. Uh, it also only has a 4K uh, uh, pattern buffer, which means you're limited to 512 uh, uh, samples for your uh, PSK and QAM and your ARB functions are a little bit limited as well. Well, thank you. Do you have any final comments or would you like to summarize in a couple sentences? Well, if uh, the limitations of the VSG25A don't pose a problem for you, it's a great value and it will produce just about any signal you need. I think that a lot of uh, uh, industry professionals will uh, really enjoy it and uh, its simplicity and performance. Well, thank you. Thank you.